What is up everybody, Hearn here. We are just jumping right into Final Form, the new card game that just got released where you are able to pledge your cards. So we're jumping right in, play now. These, these are some of the cards that I have here in my wallet already that I connected. I'm gonna make it easy. There's a pledge all cards button. Doesn't get any easier than that. Looks like it will not let me pledge my legendary. But maybe in the future, based on that info there. So I'm gonna confirm here. I have the Phantom wallet on my cell phone, so I'm gonna grab that really quick and scan this. There is a QR code that pops up on the screen there. So I just signed the signature there. It looks like it did three of six. Not sure why there. Maybe there's a limitation. So I'm gonna just scan again. Maybe it does three at a time, so keep that in mind if that's true. Code scanned, waiting for approval. Boom, there we go. Now I got all of them signed in here, pledged. That number is just climbing now. Um, it doesn't look like that'll ever stop. I have a daily output on the left there. Cards owned, Legendary 1, Epic 1, Rare 5. Looks like there are options to evolve them. But until I start getting some daily output and the materials to do that, there's not too much I can do yet. There is the claim button there to actually get that, but since I'm only at 15, I'll wait a little bit longer. I think you need at least 90 to even do anything in the Evolve tab. It is pretty cool that it shows all that info for what is pledged in the cards there. And at this moment, I realize I wish I had more cards. I might have to get some more in the near future. That daily output is looking pretty nice if you get a lot more of them. But even with the numbers there, even having one or two is going to do some damage for you to get that daily output going. Title, pledge, evolve, get cards. Yeah, I have to say the uh, UI on this game is very polished. I can tell they spent a lot of time on this here. It looks great. Shows all the different cards. I'm sure as this game evolves, there's going to be more sections than this. With the Iron Pigeons coming out tomorrow, guys. Network status. Green all around. Refreshing. Looks like it was pretty much updated already, so I don't know what that is doing exactly, unless it freezes up on the connection. Looks like you can do rare, epic, legendary. And then place the four cards there. 90 required. Okay, so I have zero so far because I didn't claim any yet. But it looks not too hard to get 90 at least for the common evolve to rare. But I'm just thinking with the output of 5500 for the rare and then 6500 for the epic. Unless I have a lot more it probably makes sense for me to just keep some rares for now otherwise I would go 4 to 1. 
a lot less decrease on output after that point. Just off of reviewing this very quickly here, if that's accurate or not. Well, I think that's pretty much it, guys. I'm sure this game will evolve as time goes on, but cards are pledged. We're getting daily output. I don't have to leave this game running to get that, so I think I can close it out, come back later, maybe hit that refresh button on the top, claim the extracted at any point in time. It seems like all of that is fairly easy to do once it's pledged, so first impressions are, man, this looks beautiful. I mean, look at that main menu even. Love it. Excited for the future. Thanks for watching, guys. Hern out.